How does cisplatin contribute to renal failure? Cisplatin, a platinum-based chemotherapy agent, poses a significant renal failure risk via various mechanisms. Direct cellular damage. Cisplatin forms reactive platinum complexes that target renal tubular cells. These complexes create cellular disruption, interfere with DNA replication, and instigate oxidative stress, resulting in cellular dysfunction. Almost 20-30% of cisplatin recipients experience renal dysfunction. Inflammatory response. Cisplatin initiates a renal inflammatory cascade, leading to pro-inflammatory cytokines and activated immune cells. This inflammation significantly contributes to renal tissue damage. Vascular constriction. Cisplatin-induced vasoconstriction restricts renal blood flow, causing ischemia and tissue hypoxia. This deteriorates renal function further, leading to acute kidney injury, Aki, rates as high as 2-3%. Electrolyte imbalance. Cisplatin disrupts renal electrolyte and fluid homeostasis. Impaired sodium and water reabsorption result in dehydration and compromised renal function. Preventive measures. Proper hydration, diuretics, and renal function monitoring can lessen cisplatin-induced renal failure risks. Nearly 50% of cisplatin-related Aki is reversible with vigilant management. Additional facts. Cisplatin is linked with both neurotoxicity and autotoxicity. The plasma half-life of cisplatin varies between 30 and 100 minutes. High-dose cisplatin, greater than 100 mg per square meter, exacerbates nephrotoxicity risks. Cisplatin is employed in multiple cancer types, including ovarian, testicular, and bladder cancers. County administration with other nephrotoxic drugs can increase the risk of renal failure. References 1. Cisplatin-induced nephrotoxicity and targets of nephroprotection, an update. 2. Cisplatin nephrotoxicity, mechanisms and renoprotective strategies.